Hi everyone. In this video, continue to give a response to some of these popular lose weight journey videos. This one is next, losing 275 pounds body weight. Actor Ethan Supley, fitness journey. Let's see what it has to say. I'm mainly looking at diet, mindset, goal setting. If you're setting. a person who does any type of activity, this is, this is the best pump to get. No matter where I am, I can just quickly type in a few numbers and it'll give me some insulin rather Randy, those are poison. How poison? Put it down. Yeah, there was a huge period of time where I would only eat while riding the bike, um, which is not healthy or sustainable. And, you know, it's for sure trading one mm -hmm. addiction for another at that point. Have you been that way with a lot of stuff, like even with like your acting career? Like when you got it, when you get into something and when you get going on something, is it? I do kind of go, yeah, I do go pretty hard into stuff <laughs> I get into. I am in this moment really trying to just practice like so this guy you don't has really know your baseline overweight for a long time you got to go from there so you did some keto did you were you able to lose some weight from there yeah yeah i i, I found keto to be super awesome and for weight loss uh i just got to a point where i wasn't seeing the muscle definition that i wanted and so i i then like went and looked at a bunch of like bodybuilding stuff and was like okay if i enter in carbs and i'm in a caloric deficit like religiously let's see what that does and that's what i've been doing for the last 50 pounds mm. and I, it's been yeah. I've, I've really liked it for you know my whole life my parents we lived in los angeles so it was a lot of like um so basically uh he said he started keto work but then it he doesn't he didn't get the muscularity so he had to start adjusting the only thing about keto is that it's hard to do it for a lifetime and it's not so safe. And Dr. Atkins, actually the keto diet originated from the Atkins diet. And Dr. Atkins died from obesity, like 80 pounds overweight. And uh, she would always say, every time you go on a strict diet, we gain weight because I would like take my desires for food and sublimate them into cooking stuff that I wouldn't even eat, but I'm he's talking about some kind of the how how much do I have to offset that? Do I have to put in drawbacks. a little bit more movement that day right. to balance it and and I... see anything is he giving any kind of summary at the end? Let's see. So obesity. I, I was a big guy. I was heavy. I was three hundred and thirty pounds. But I was also a 330 pound power lifter. And I don't know what he felt like. I never went through school as like the fat kid. I wasn't like, I didn't look around and be like, I am the fattest kid in this grade. I'm the fattest kid in this area. I'm fat. I never, I never dealt with that, but I know a lot of people do. And this is someone I would imagine you had to deal with a lot of that. Overcoming that is, is a crazy and insane battle. I want to try to help people get through that and get past that. But again, I don't. I have empathy towards it. I never lived that part of it. So while I was big, I never was on that side of the fence. And I really think it's admirable on what he's done. It's, it's amazing. It's really cool. Yeah. Thank you. I appreciate it. I'm, I'm, I get, I, I have a mixture of looking in the mirror and feeling total pride and looking in the mirror and feeling uh, completely overwhelmed with how much more I have to do. <laughs> you know. He has a nice personality, very humble. I've known the word my whole life. Um, but basically, he adjusts. I like that he monitor and adjusts. He did. He had keto keto success, but then saw some weaknesses, and then he stopped. He adjusts the monitor, gets some more carbs, and so on, and he keeps going. So, and he has a like a companion, a coach, I think, to help him. So, those are some good ideas. All right, don't forget to click subscribe. I'm going to go to the next video and give a response.